Hi, I'm Bill Myers and this is my video tip of the week. This week I'm going to show you a program that I use to watermark a lot of photos. And when I say watermark, what I mean is I have a lot of photos that I want to put on the web and on some of those photos I want to put a copyright and maybe a timestamp. And this program I'm going to show you right now can do that quite easily. First of all, the program is called Mark It Now and it is freeware, which means you can download it and use it all you want without paying. If you choose to, you can make a donation. The way it works is you load the program up, then you go down to input files and you select a folder on your computer that has a photo or a selection of photos and then you select the photos that you want to add watermarks to. Here's a couple of photos I've added that I'm going to add a watermark to. And then you go up to text watermark and you put in the place where you want the watermark to, to be shown. Now I want watermarks to be shown in the lower right so I select bottom right and then I give it a 5% margin, a 5% margin there transparency has to do with how well this watermark over here will be seen and I generally want to push my transparency up so that there, there is a watermark but that doesn't override the photo itself and then you select font and I use Courier New and bold and a uh, 36 font size and click OK then you select color and you can choose any color you want we'll select an orange right now just so that you can see that you can see it down here I'm going to make the transparency zero so you can see it better and I'll zoom in so you can see how nice a watermark it makes. You can see the, the watermark right there. And then here you enter the text for the watermark. For example, I might want to put copyright Hamilton New Media and then the, the date. And if I click Advanced, it allows me to choose whether I want to put a date there or not. I can put the current date or the file creation date or the file modification date. Right now I'm just going to put the current date and then apply the text to the image. I can also put image watermarks there if I want. When I output it, I can output the uh, image to the same directory but append a suffix to the image name. That way I'm not overriding the actual image itself. I'm creating a new image with a watermark. Or I can output it to a totally different directory. And the output format is going to be the same. I can just keep it. It'll take that image and it'll make it the same. Now, when I mentioned date earlier, it'll pull the date of the image right off the image file itself. So your watermark can include things like uh, copyright and the image date, or you may not want the image date on it. Anyway, this is a free program. It's called Mark It Now, and you can download it from here. I'm Bill Myers. This has been one of my video tips of the week. You can find more video tips like this at www.bmyers.com.